Sudan is grappling with a severe cholera outbreak that has claimed at least 22 lives and infected hundreds, according to health authorities on Sunday. The crisis unfolds as the country endures a 16-month-long conflict and devastating floods exacerbating the already dire situation. Health Minister Haydam Mohammad Ibrahim confirmed 354 cholera cases that has been detected across the nation, with fatalities rising amidst the ongoing chaos. The World Health Organization WHO reported that cholera has killed 78 people and sickened over 2,400 others in Sudan since January. Cholera, a highly contagious and fast-spreading infection causing severe dehydration, is transmitted through contaminated food or water. The outbreak initially emerged in Kasala province and has since spread to nine localities across the provinces and most affected individuals reportedly unvaccinated. WHO is now coordinating with Sudanese health authorities to launch a vaccination campaign. This outbreak adds to Sudan's mounting woes as the country has been torn apart by conflict since April 2023. The violence which has devastated Khartoum and other urban areas has led to the collapse of the healthcare system and displaced over 10.7 million people. Meanwhile, seasonal floods have killed dozens and displaced 118,000 more further straining resources. Amid this turmoil, Sudan's military-controlled Sovereign Council announced plans to meet with U.S. officials in Cairo to discuss a peace deal with the paramilitary rapid support forces under pressure from international diplomats to find a resolution to the ongoing conflict. Well, that's it for now. With this information, we wrap up today's story. Please stay tuned to U.S. Most Read and please consider hitting the subscribe button. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.